Most people associate hype moments in esports with grand finals, huge tournaments, or close matches with a ton on the line. But sometimes, history is made when you least expect it, like in the case of the legendary Daigo Perry, also known as EVO Moment 37. It was the loser's finals at the Street Fighter III Third Strike Tournament at Evolution 2004, competing for a spot in the grand finals, Daigo Umehara and Justin Wong, among the best Japanese and American Street Fighter III players respectively. The game had been out for five years at this point, and with the match just getting started, no one really anticipated any groundbreaking strategies or revolutionary play. Once the game kicked off, the contrast between Justin and Daigo's playstyles was immediately evident. Daigo, nicknamed the Beast for his ferocious skill, is famous for his uncannily calculated approach. Part of what earned him the reputation as perhaps the greatest Street Fighter player of all time was his ability to constantly be thinking several steps ahead, a combination of predictive and reactive strategies that caused some to joke that he might be psychic. And we're off. Great reaction, there you go. Oh. Oh. Walk into the neutral oh. jump again. Oh. Oh. What? Oh. <laughs> What a first round from Daigo. I said he might try care. something, seeing as he's in winner's bracket, but I didn't see that coming. Justin, on the other hand, takes a more dynamic approach, shifting from an ultra-safe turtling style until just the right moment, before striking like a coiled snake. He was also known for being something of a show-off, with his penchant for flashy finishes perhaps stemming from his background in the explosive Marvel vs. Capcom series. Come on, Chun Li was the perfect counter to Daigo's Ken. As without openings to capitalize on, Daigo was forced to play much more aggressively than he would have liked. Eventually, he became frustrated, with cracks beginning to form in the normally Zen like player's game plan. Before you knew it, it was game point. And even though there were several games to go before a winner would be crowned, Daigo wasn't ready to give up so easily. With only a pixel of health left, meaning even a blocked hit would result in a KO. Daigo backed off, practically daring Justin to attempt a flashy super to close out the round. Justin, thinking he had an easy win, obliged. And the rest, as they say, is history. Without missing a beat, Daigo parried every single hit of Chan Li's super. To ward off all 17 hits without taking any damage, the Beast had to properly time his parries within fractions of a second each, and over the screaming of an electrified crowd as well. Now considered the defining moment in fighting game history, the Daigo parry, or Evil Moment 37 as it would later be known, is said to have birthed a whole new generation of fighting game fans, and is still to this day remembered referenced and looked back on as the moment the beast became a god.